Howdy folks, welcome to the Crypto Naturalist Makeup Tutorial. I'm here with Leslie to show you some daily basic makeup tips. Now in terms of skin care, it's important to know what's right for you. Leslie's using a light BB cream. BB I believe stands for Beauty Balm or Blemish Balm. Followed up by some powder to set. Leslie uses bare minerals to signal to rocks that she's a friend. Next we have some mascara to dissuade predators that only eat eyelashes. And we're on to eyeshadow. Using bright colors is a tried and true method to tell those in the environment that you're toxic or possibly venomous. Emphasizing the eye is also a way to tell the environment that you're paying attention, which is just common politeness. When applying eyeshadow, it's important to follow the contour of the eye. Contouring, not to be confused with condoring, in which you use makeup to look like a giant vulture. Purple is a traditional color of royalty, which will signal to monarchical creatures that you're a person of importance. When applying eye makeup, it's important to take your time. Remember the old saying, the eye is the window to the soul, the doorway to the brain, and the front porch to the nose. Eyeliner's nice because, well, just really makes the eyes pop. Ah, uh, now Leslie's switching to an eyeshadow pencil to begin sketching in the false eyes that will confuse observers. A cluster pattern is always a good idea when using false eyes. After all, spiders use a cluster pattern, and I know when I think of spiders, the first thing I think is role model. An eyeliner marker for uh, detailed work. When you're sketching in full size, asymmetry is your friend. It can signal that, well, you're a creature that doesn't observe the typical bilateral symmetry of this world, or even suggest that you are, in reality, a swarm of creatures. Basic camouflage to break up the lines of the face should be a standard part of any beauty regimen. Here, Leslie is applying the camouflage technique of cheetahs and leopards to help conceal her position when she's out on the savanna. In terms of camouflage, often less is more. Notice the subtlety and restraint in Leslie's technique. Makeup is, among other things, a tool of communication. Think about what it is you're trying to communicate. Whether that's professionalism, self-confidence, acute toxicity, or even cosmic horror. When planning out your full size for the day, consider a large round eye of this fashion. This suggests a cephalopod, like a giant squid or an octopus. This is a particularly effective tool for dissuading predators, as many cephalopods are masters of disguise. And it will be perfectly believable that you're simply an octopus disguised as a human. This is particularly effective against bears who, of course, remember their long war with octopus kind. Makeup is a fun way to express yourself and look like a lethal chimera out in the wild. And we finish with a bright purple lipstick because, well, it's cute.
There now, a look at a basic daily makeup regimen for a strange and wonderful creature just like you. Leslie's ready to go out and face the wild. For more insights on strange nature, listen to the Crypto Naturalist Podcast anywhere you find podcasts or at CryptoNaturalist.com.